cool. I was happy about it, but like, to me, it really doesn't mean anything if you don't work and grind, because you can have a title, but like, if you just sitting there on the couch playing video games and stuff like that, it's not going to mean anything. You got to put the work into it, because once you get up to college, the rankings are not going to be a two star, you know, a five star. Um, my middle school coach always told me that it was a five star who went to a school and never played because he ended up quitting because everything was handed to him in high school. And I'm not going to like that at all. So I, I grind, I work for everything I got, and I'm going to continue to do that when I'm up there with you. To that point, though, I mean, I've seen you play, so obviously other people have seen you play too. Is there any, just for your own, whatever goal is you want to check off, any validation for you period to see that, you know, it's actually being acknowledged that you are a five star talent? Like, are you happy to see that validated? I mean, I really, rankings, I'm happy to be a five star, but to me, rankings doesn't mean anything to me because once you're on the field, it doesn't matter who you are, the work. How did it feel to get around the other guys? That, other it was commits? cool. It was my first time seeing Gabe and Desan. Yeah. So, I've seen Tagger and Jair a lot, so it was cool. I think I would have gone see him next week at the spring game, too. So. Is he as goofy in person as he yes, is? Yes, 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 <laughs> 100%. What's that like going from building a relationship with somebody, you know, over the phone, texting, those kind of things, to then meeting in person? Um, it's not really that different, to be honest with you. You talk about how you keep working. What are the biggest areas in which you are looking to still improve right now? Um, just being mobile. I'm gaining weight. I'm 218. I'm waiting at 218 today. I'm trying to stay between 215 and 220. I'm starting to track. But next year, I'm going to start running back. I'm starting to receive from a kick return and linebacker. So, um, <laughs> but, um, just staying mobile and be able to go and making sure my appearance is where it needs to be so I can be able to play. Do you see yourself as a guy who could potentially play that bullet kind of role at Ohio State? I don't, to be honest, yes, but like when I get up there, wherever the coach will put me, that's going whatever, wherever the coach will put me because I just want to play football and help a team as best way I can. So you feel like any position you're going to succeed? Every, any position they put me in, I'm going to work my best to. Yes, sir. What do you think are your best qualities that allow you to be able to do that? Um, I give it 110% give it 110% everything that I do. Um, no matter what it is, I'm going to work on it, and I'm a leader too, so if somebody needs help, I'm going to help them, even helping them can also help me. So. Do you think, you know, that athleticism that you have gives you maybe a level of versatility that some guys wouldn't have? Yes, yeah, sir, but like, now, nowadays, you see guys like Isaiah Simmons, you see guys like the Sound of Color, who's 6'6", 220, and plays everything, so I guess it's like the new age linebacker, so. Yes, we were staying, but it's like we build our relationship with Coach Washington. I kept 
keep it real with him. I called him. I said, Coach, I'm thinking about taking a job. He said, I'm going to look out. That's what I'm going to worry about. And, and it's a whole heart to heart for like 40 minutes. And, yeah, he's still a buck out. So. How does he have you fitting into the defense at Ohio State? What, what position do you feel you're best suited for? Um, he told me he'll put me in like the three. Washington left. What is it about Ohio State that transcends even who your coach would be? Probably just this foot out and the coaching staff and Coach Dick. Um, I love the coaching staff up there. I love them. No matter what position they in, receivers, running backs, Coach Alfred out here with his son, Coach Dolby, Cool Dude, um, Coach Wilson, all the coaches.